Thank you, Jolena. Starbucks seems to pop up on every corner, but there is one corner where people don't want to see the popular drink spot. And unfortunately for the people opposed, the addition is happening. That's because on Monday, Fort Myers City Council voted to approve a new drive through only Starbucks on the corner of Six Mile Cypress and Colonial Boulevard. Now take a look. This is in the parking lot of a Walmart that is already near a busy Chick-fil-A gas station and several other businesses. The Starbucks is said to be a prototype and the first of its kind in the nation with a separate line for mobile orders. But for the people we spoke with, they tell us it's a grande problem. If you've ever entered the Walmart parking lot on the corner of Six Miles Cypress and Colonial Boulevard, these sounds might be familiar to you. Coming here to Walmart, like I have to go all the way to Naples and back to get around the Walmart so I can get inside, you know what I mean? I almost hit somebody right here just driving between the liquor store and Chick-fil-A. Oh my gosh, it's the worst. I avoid it at all costs if I can. So when we told customers a new kind of drive through Starbucks is on its way to the same spot. It is literally the first one in the nation that's going to be done. Like the coffee, people were hot and pressed about the issue. With the traffic that that will create, Including the traffic here with the Chick-fil-A, I don't know what they're doing. It's not safe, to be honest with you. Um, it's more congestion, um, it's more, it's angrier drivers. It's a terrible idea. Put it anywhere else. Fort Myers City Council member Johnny Streets expressed some of the same concerns at last night's meeting. I would be proud to say this is the first one in the country, but I wouldn't be proud to say this is the first one in the country that got hit, somebody got hit by a car. With a vote of four to two, council members voted to approve the development, but drivers in the area remain skeptical. They just need to put, you know, 16 more lanes on Colonial and everything would be dandy. Well, developers working with the Starbucks told Fort Myers City Council that the entire project has been in accordance with the city's traffic department. They also insist that safety will be kept in mind throughout the permitting and engineering process.